is on EA Sports, and we are in Silicon Valley at Levi Stadium in Santa Clara. Today, we've got a good NFC matchup on tap between the Arizona Cardinals and the San Francisco 49ers. Robbie Gold's got it on the tee. He kicks it off, and here we go from Levi Stadium. This will be brought out from the middle of the end zone. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. First play and a first pass for Murray. And incomplete to open things up. Different pass rushes are designed for different things. Sometimes you want to keep the quarterback in the pocket. Sometimes you want him to flush. I don't know exactly how this one was designed, but they made sure they moved him to his right. He got out of the pocket. Unfortunately for him, he was hit as he tried to throw the ball, and that resulted in an incompletion. So they'll wind up losing five yards on the play, and they're going to be staring at a third and long here. Now hold everything here. We're going to get a timeout by the offense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And that will be incomplete. That's the first third down trap of the game. And clearly something was off in the execution of that play. Good news, they've got a whole game left to clean that up and start clicking on those key third down throws. Murray and company going for it on fourth. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. A surprising move here on the opening drive of the game. And this defense delivers a turnover on downs on the very first drive of the afternoon. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. Davis Price on first and 10. He will push his way down to about the 14. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. Second down, and again, it's Davis Price. It's a nice pickup at 12 yards, and it gives him a first and goal. Davis Price. He is not going anywhere. He'll be hit and dropped for no gain at the two-yard line. They'll try and run for it with Davis Price. And across the goal line, into the end zone. Touchdown, 49ers. Ty Davis Price taking it in from two yards out. And the 49ers are on the board first here this afternoon. Gold with the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. After the touchdown, it's Robbie Gold now to kick it away. And here comes a return from the middle of the end zone. And he's only going to make it to the 13-yard line and no further. Ready to go with their next drive and at the line, the Cardinal offense. As this offense gets ready here for this drive, Charles, you, you still wonder about that prior drive. Went for it on fourth down in their own territory, didn't get it, and then that led to a touchdown on the other side. And I don't mind the aggressiveness. In fact, I'm usually a huge fan of it, but I just want teams to always weigh risk and reward. To me, too early in this game because reward just wasn't big enough to go for it there in case they failed. 
Now the pressure, back on their offense to pick themselves up, and they gave the touchdown that was just given up. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here at a third and eight. <laughs> They'll fake it to Connor. Now Murray. And that ball incomplete, nearly intercepted. Took a chance with that one. It'll lead to a fourth down. Every offense tells you they want to come out and start fast. That's not unusual at all. But this group, they've yet to get much rolling through their first two drives. It looks like they're going to have to give up the football again after this one. Murray sets to throw on fourth. And this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. And he is going to have the Cardinals first down as they wind up with a gain of 11 there on fourth down. 11 yards on the pickup, and it's good enough for an Arizona first. Counting down toward the midway point in quarter one. Play action. Now it's Murray. And he finds his tight end. It's Ertz. And he gets this up across the 35 before he's out of bounds. So the completion results there in nine yards. And it'll bring up a second and short. Nice play call. A little bit of play action right there. If you can get those linebackers to freeze for just a split second, that's usually all the room you need in order to get it to your tight end. Play fake. Murray. A quick throw knocked away and incomplete. Receiver coaches preach to their guys all the time. Separation, that's what's going to make the play successful. That time there was very little, and I think they were actually fortunate that it was only knocked away and not intercepted. Murray to air it out again. Over the middle, complete. That's more. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. That's good for nine yards as they convert on the third down play. So after two first downs, they get another here. First and 10 at the 45. They'll go option to the short side. And he's got this one across midfield into 49er territory. On second down, Connor looking for space. And he stopped after a gain of one. Not enough. Still a yard to go on third down. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. Gets this to Ertz. And this will move the chains again as the tackle is going to be made at the 49ers' 31-yard line. And they run the option here on first and 10. And he slides and covers up at the end as he's going to be able to pick up decent yardage. From the 24, Murray. Oh, it's tipped, but he still makes the adjustment. And this will move the chains again as the tackle's going to be made at the 49ers' 15-yard line. After one, 7 nothing on EA Sports. Line of scrimmage, the 15, it's first and 10. Murray giving to Connor on the option. They yeah, give him four yards there, it'll be second and six. On play action, it's Murray. Throw right side, complete to Williams. And inside the five here before he's out of bounds right at the three. Seven yards on the pick up there, and now they've got it first and goal. From the gun, Murray. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Picked by Emmanuel Mosley. And the 49ers are going to take over here on the INT at their own five-yard line. CD, when he went to throw that, I'm not sure if he just didn't see where the defense was. Whatever the case, not the throw you're looking for on first and goal. 
Not at all, because look, let's face it, that close to the goal line, if you throw an interception, it's going to hurt on any down. But really, the only down you can kind of live with is if you do it on fourth down. The first three, if you don't have it wide open, just get rid of it. Make sure they can't get it and live to fight another down. First and goal, and you throw the pick, not good at all. The second down play, not much better than the first. Just a gain of one there. When we talk about defenders, specifically linebackers, keeping their eyes in the right spot. He had that eye down the entire time. And you know that's not easily done because they throw a lot of misdirection at you. They try and fool you and get your eyes in the wrong place. But you're right about that one. He correctly figured that one out and made a really nice play. That'll go for a gain of 13, helping big time to get away from that end zone. First down. Give to Davis Price up the middle here. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Second down, and again, it's Davis Price. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. This will be a loss of three, and now a much tougher third down looming. The running lanes have definitely not been there for him here in the first half, and I don't think it's all been his fault. His offensive line hasn't given him much space. A loss results okay, there. Right? Throwing his lance on third down. Gets it out wide to Davis Price. Well, this is going to depend on the spot, but it's not a very generous one. He looks to be about a yard or so short. And they'll go for it. Lance. The first catch of the game for George Kittle. He's at the 30. 10. Touchdown, 49ers. George Kittle, 73 yards. And the 49ers' decision to go for it pays off with six points. Gold able to tack on the extra point, and it's now 14 to nothing. After the touchdown, it's Robbie Gold now to kick it away. And this is going to be returned from the middle of the end zone. And the decision to come out of the end zone is going to cost him five yards as he's taken down right at the 20. Ready to go with their next drive, and at the line, the Cardinal offense. As the offense comes out here, Charles, remember they threw the interception last time out, but they were moving the football down the field. Looked like they were going to have a sustained drive that ended in points, but then the pick ensued. And because of that, there's no way you can call the last drive a success. Yes, there are things to build on because they found some play calls at work. Now they've got to build another drive and find a way to avoid the turnover the plague did on the last one. And that's caught inside the 35. The Cardinals forced to burn their third and final timeout as the stoppage will come with a little under a minute to go in this first half. So the big play has them all the way down to the 30 now for first and 10. Now Murray. And this is caught. It's Brown. Touchdown. Marquise Brown, 30 yards. And the Cardinals are on the board here in the final minute of the first half. Oh, and now they're going to fake it. And Murray in trouble here, and down he goes. Uh, let me go ahead and show my age a little bit. I liked it when they would fake it from the three-yard line, right? When you'd line up, go ahead, and oh, there's a fake, and now he's going to get two. That's great. But from the 15... The risk-reward, it's just not there. It's so risky to get 15 yards on a fake. Oh, you see the result right there. Yeah, I know these young whippersnappers are trying to do different things in this game, but let's go back to old reliable. Kick the ball through the post. Get off my lawn. Yeah, that's darn right. Ready? Davis Price up the middle. 
And the big boys up front, they're going to stop him right at the line. No gain on the play. It'll be second down. Ready. Here's Lance to throw it. He gets this one to Davis Price. And he's brought down inside the 20 at the 18-yard line. The 49ers now going to use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 21 seconds to go here in the first half. Throwing on first down is Lance. And this is going to be intercepted. Jalen Thompson picks it. And his guys have got it back in the closing stages of the first half. And the Cards are going to get the football here as the ball will come out to the 20. Ready to go with their next drive. And at the line, the Cardinal offense. After the turnover, here's Murray. Going down the middle, and it's complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. First half in the books. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Welcome back. Charles and I settled into the booth ready for quarter number three. It's the 49ers out in front, and they will get the football first as well as we are back and started in the second half. Returning from his end zone is Ray Ray McLeod. And tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. And Charles, they've got the lead. Put your coaching hat on here now. What's the game plan for the second half? I think getting the running game going a little bit more because I thought in the first half, they didn't get it moving the way that they would like. They had success throwing it. But I think these first couple of drives, they want to get those running backs going and give them more opportunities. And I will guarantee you that those guys were lobbying for them in the locker room at halftime. Give him four on the ground there. They're now left with third and six. They are in need of six yards here if they hope to move the chains. Throwing now is Lance. And able to haul it in is Kittle. They find some open field here. And out across midfield down to the 45. Give him four. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield. It's first and 10 from the 45. On the handoff, Davis Price. And here he'll be brought down a little shy of the 35 at the 36. A good position to be in here, second and inches. Second down, and again, it's Davis Price. And he'll go down at the 28. Seven yards there and a first down. Well, you certainly have to give a little credit here because they're playing this game now at their pace. This is ball control football, sustained runs, taking their time, and making it work. Davis Price once more. Might have gotten this one down to the 28, and that's all. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. Second down. Here's Davis Price. And he'll take this down just shy of the 25-yard line. A gain of two there on the heels of a one-yard pickup on first. Eighth play of the drive, forthcoming, and they need eight yards on third down. Now Lance. Fighting his safety valve here. That's complete. 
And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made here at the Cardinals' 13-yard line. A good gain of 14 there, and it moves the chains. Here's a give to Davis Price. Had a nice job to break free of one tackle, but it slowed his momentum somewhat, and he's taken down right after. Ready? Second down, and again, it's Davis Price. And across the chalk, into the end zone. It's a four-minute touchdown. Ty Davis Price with his second touchdown of the afternoon. And the 49ers take the opening kickoff of the third quarter and drive right down the field to extend their lead. Gold with the extra point, and the lead is up to 15 now. After the touchdown, it's Robbie Gold now to kick it away. This will be brought out from the middle of the end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. Ready to go with their next drive, and at the line, the Cardinal offense. Well, the opposition laid down the challenge and opening drive touchdown here to start the second half. And Charles, now you feel like this group need trying to fit it into more, but it's intercepted. Picked up by Trevor. 